Hi there guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I have every single item, so I'm going to be telling you guys if it's worth it or not. So, st so starting with the orange candy, mm, I don't know what to think about it. It's pretty uh, useless, but that's kind of the whole point. What it does, it'll explode you like a couple of feet up in the air. Next up, we got the uh, pumpkin. I'd say this... Mm, get it if you want. I get it because... Ah, uh, it's exclusive. Only for this. So, yep. Of course, I had to buy everything. So, uh... Oh, yeah. Stick around to the end of the video, as I'll show you an unreleased item in that specific area. Anyways, moving on, we got this little pumpkin. Pretty basic. You can do, like, a little, uh, pumpkin patch store, if you guys want. Yeah, worth it. Next up, we got the, uh, little jack-o'-lantern. Pretty much the same, but it's carved, and you could color the inside this time. Like that. Uh, I'm not sure about this pumpkin. I have not tried this one yet. You can make a snowball pumpkin with this one. Uh, the jack-o'-lantern pumpkin, pretty worth it, I gotta say. The screaming skull. It, the screaming skull is one of my favorite items that they've currently released. What it does, it has uh, six voice lines. So, uh, where is it? Where's the wiring stuff? It's over here. This one has six different voice lines. Like that. That. That's one, two. We got that one again. Three. Four. Five. And six. No. Seven. There we go. Next up, we got the blue candy. Pretty basic. What it does is it'll freeze you for a certain amount of time. As we see here. Like, right there. It, is, it does get pretty annoying, though, because it lasts longer than the snowball. And we're moving on, we got the Halloween 2024 set. Now, the one thing I gotta say is this is worth it. Uh, currently, you guys cannot see it, though. On. But moving on, we got the little ghost gnome. Pretty basic. It's just a little ghost. But a gnome version. And, I, I, I don't know. It's your. It's really your guys' choice. Anyways, we got the monster sign. We got it right over here. Now, what this does, it'll just change the game out to monster, like, ma in Monster House. So, yeah, pretty basic. By the way, all of these are made in Blender. Uh, if you guys did not know, I'm currently working on a game myself. Just that, uh, I'm not released a, the, uh, Halloween update, sadly. Currently, I only had the version to it. It's pretty broken, though. Anyways, moving on, we get the little pumpkin pillow. Basic too. It's just a giant pumpkin, but pillow. Worth it, still though. Next up, we got the little organ pipe. Now this one has uh, three different colors, but I'll just only do orange. Now I actually have been waiting for that item to come out. So I'd say it's worth it, I guess. I'm not sure. Anyways, we got the gnome. Now, basically, what the gnome is, it's when you press it. When you press it, its eyes are glowing red. It's like basically like a little imposter gnome. Anyways, moving on, we got the little green uh, candy. What this does is red will slow you down, and green is just basically the radiation, the radiation bomb. Now this is just basically this, but it's overlaid. Next up, prison bars. Eh, I don't know, because people will jail you up with this. 
But if you guys are actually making a real jail, then it's kind of on your guys' choice on how you guys use that. Anyways, moving on with the pumpkin gnome. Now, this guy is perfect for trick-or-treating right here. He would just disguise himself as a little pumpkin. Uh, scare some little kids. Next up, we got the little trick-or-treating gnome. This guy's perfect for grabbing some candy. Yeah, let's go give him some candy. Mm, let's go give him this orange candy. Here he goes, eh? Nice. And he's pretty, uh, I'd say he's worth it if you guys are gonna do some trick-or-treating with him. Just moving on. We got this, the pumpkin bomb. It, it explodes into three tiny little explosions. You pick it up, throw it at people, and it'll explode immediately. Next up, we got the 2x2 two two web. Just right over here. Pretty basic. It's one of my favorite items. Anyways, moving on. We got the white candy. What this does is, you'll see in a minute. Remove all of your cotton. But as we see, I don't see it. Anyways... Pumpkin 2024 piece 3 that I currently have on. Mm, I don't know. Is it worth it or not? I don't know. It's really your guys' choice on how you use these. Now, let's move on. We got the corner web. Now. And I don't know about this one. It's pretty hard. It's, it's based off of what you guys use for it, though. Moving on, we got the tombstone. Personally, one of my favorite blocks. Uh, it's pretty perfect if you want to troll your friend thinking that they're dead. Anyways, we got the 4x4 web. Actually, I want to keep this one here. Anyways. Moving on. We got the 2024 piece 3 for the Halloween update. Personally, one of my favorites, too. This entire set is kind of my favorite. Ooh, now we got the rainbow candy. Now what it does is, it's kind of a little mix. It'll, it'll, uh, it's basically all, every single candy combined into one. Alright, moving on. We got the little Spuda. One in my absolute favorite block that they've released. Like, come on, who, who could have said no to that cute little face, man? I'm just gonna, uh, throw him in there. Because I cannot just remove him. Anyways, we got the Halloween piece, piece 5, which, as we see, we have it on. Next up, we got the pumpkin bomb. Pretty perfect for trolling, but yet it'll get annoying sometimes. Still. Anyways, we've got Halloween 2024 piece 6, the last piece. It, I, I, I also have it on. It's every single piece of this Halloween item is just worth it. We got the Witch Gnome. Now, something that's interesting is something that I originally thought is you could change it's like the green color no it's actually just this entire thing pretty interesting though next up the final item well second to last hey, you guys may be wondering oh what hold on wait a minute what do you mean second to last well if you guys remember in the beginning of the video i said that I have a unreleased cosmetic. Anyways, moving on, we got the witch broom. Personally, one of my favorites. You climb onto a high place and watch them. Ah, oh, crap. Maybe, maybe the magic cannot start yet. Okay, now the magic can start. It's kind of like an umbrella, but you can go upwards too. Pretty interesting. Now, moving on to this room. Oh, there's Spuda. Down in this room, if we take a look 
to our left. Here he is, the one and only mummified gnome. Now this guy's unreleased, so uh, if you guys see him, I'd recommend getting him before he's completely sold out. Now this guy's my favorite, favorite, like my absolute favorite. Other than the spider, the spider is still my number one. Anyways, but uh, this guy, this guy right here, he's special. He's a little special little goober. Ain't that right, mummified gnome? Oh, was that you, you're telling the viewers to like and subscribe? So early? Come on, man. You, you gotta get it timing. You gotta get it timing correct, man. Anyways. Enough talking to, uh, that guy. He's a little off the rim. Now, something I like to, uh, see these brooms as is a little jetpack. Anyways, when you do that, it, it has a little effects up behind it, too. A little fun fact. I have no purpose for this room. But this is the end of the video. Okay, mummified gnome. Now tell us to- Now tell the viewers to like subscribe. Like and subscribe. Th now that's what I'm talking about. You gotta real speak up though. I have no clue if you guys catched what he, he said though. Because he couldn't speak up. Because he, he's a little zombie now. Ain't that right, Goober? The thing. Stop. S be normal for once, my man. Dear God. Anyways. Let's go put this guy in here. Because soon, every single one of these items will be rare. So I recommend getting every single thing on this tech web unless if you can't anyways moving on uh, we got a whole bunch of these for right now we only have these though i'm pretty sure i've always i really want to get this pumpkin it'll, it'll match really well how many days left six yeah i'm yeah, I can get him. Six days. Yeah, it'll, it'll only take me like four days if I get all my daily challenges done. Anyways. Make sure to join, uh, I don't know, like, H-I-G-H, hi, -H -I to, uh, see me, cause, when a new update drops, I will be in this code. Uh, like, I don't know, like, four or something. When I get out of school. Cause normally it's, these updates uh, come in when I'm at school, so. Uh, three and four, like, just wait a little bit and then you guys might see me in this code cut high. And I forgot to uh, put on some music. Uh, oh well. Next video, there will be music, though. Anyways, make sure to like, subscribe, and peace out.